If you use a pneumatic compression device for swelling, lipedema, or lymphedema, and truthfully, many people are using it to promote lymphatic system health, we have to understand that we just can't compress our legs or our limbs. We really have to understand that when we compress, all that lymph fluid has to move up to your major lymph vessels. What I see is a lot of people sit with compression on their legs and they're bent over their phone and they're sitting like this. When we put our head forward and our shoulders forward, we're limiting lymph flow through the major lymph vessels by the subclavian vein. So we're limiting how that compression is gonna work. We wanna do two things when we're working with compression. You wanna open up the major lymph vessels first. We do that with the lymph man shoulder shuffle 20 or 30 times, two or three times a day. This is gonna to begin to open up and improve lymph flow through my body. I'm feeling tingling in my legs and in my arms. Next, we wanna take some deep breaths because deep breathing pulls lymph flow through your body. So we go. Just about 10 times will make a big difference while you're doing your compression. And then after the compression, I would do those exact same things, the lymph man shoulder shuffle and take a few deep breaths. I hope that helps your compression and how you deal with your edema.